According to the American Heart Association, about 40,000 Americans are born each year with a congenital heart condition. Most are diagnosed at birth, but less severe problems involving abnormal openings between chambers of the heart sometimes escape detection until adulthood and have been known to cause stroke and heart failure. Typically, open-heart surgery is required to correct the defect. However, one university hospital cardiologist is bypassing the traditional method for a newer, minimally invasive one. A transcatheter closure is a procedure we use in our cath lab to help close a hole that we've detected in the person's heart. We see two main kinds here. One is a patent foramen ovale, but in people who've had a stroke, we go in there to close this defect to help prevent a second stroke. The second type is an atrioseptal defect that, again, has been present from birth, but using a catheter to close these defects prevents the need for open-heart surgery. The non-surgical procedure involves a catheter, which is inserted into a large vein through a small incision in the inner thigh or groin area. The catheter is advanced into the heart through this vein. A patch or occluder device resembling a small closed umbrella and made of nickel, titanium, and polyester fabric is inserted into the damaged area through the catheter and then opened and pulled tight against the tissue to close the defect. Comparing an open heart surgery procedure to close a defect in the heart to a transcatheter closure is like the difference between night and day in terms of the anesthesia and the recovery time that surgery involves. These surgical procedures have very low risk. On the other hand, a transcatheter closure is also very low risk, but people are up and around within a day. The transcatheter procedure, which takes about an hour, usually results in a much shorter hospital stay, reduced scarring that is limited to the leg area where the catheter was inserted, and an easier, more rapid recovery. When you can close a hole using a transcatheter approach compared to open heart surgery, the benefit there is to me an obvious benefit that recovery time is so much less and uh, trauma to the overall person is so much less and again being aware that that's possible and that we have the capability here is a very important uh, thing for people to know.